Hello, Magmi here. Today I'd like to talk about uh, my uh, Wyon Canvas 13. Uh, it's the device I've been uh, using for over three years and um, today I'd like to talk about if I like it, if it's worth spending money and stuff like that. Uh, so yeah, um, like I said, bought it three years ago and it was pretty heavily used. Uh, I, used I used it uh, for somewhere between seven, eight hours a day, so that was a lot. And um, yeah, it's still working, so that's uh, fantastic for me because it was... I bought it for uh, something like, I don't remember, uh, over 1000 slots, so it was like uh, quick math uh, 200 dollars or something like that. So it, uh, but for example, Wacom is much more expensive, so uh, <laughs> yeah, I was expecting a cheap knockoff that would stop working for like one year after, um, but yeah, so. Uh, I'm happily surprised that uh, it works, it works fine, fine like uh, okay. Um, so yeah, it works pretty well, but there are some things that could have been made better. I mean, uh, for example, this uh, stand, it comes with it, it has a pretty narrow what do you say, bridge, the, the plate that the tablet stays on. I had accidents where my tablet just moved from it, I mean it slided right into the floor and that was scary. Unfortunately, uh, unfortunately <laughs> nothing happened to it, but yeah, uh, I have to be extra careful with it. The other thing is uh, the pen stylus. I mean, the pen thingy, uh, it doesn't, it has problems with connecting with uh, the monitor. I mean, uh, it doesn't come with the tilt, uh, what do you call it? I don't, um, I don't know. Uh, so it isn't very... So it isn't really accurate, uh, but it's not really something I had problem with. It's something you can adjust or something like that. <laughs> I know it's not perfect, that's for sure. But uh, if I had a choice back then in three years ago to buy better product like Wacom, I, would, I wouldn't. I just would choose Voyan again. I know it's pretty uh, effective, <laughs> and but for me it works. It's just something uh, you have to ask a uh, question yourself. Do you use a uh, drawing tablet that much? And do you need uh, to, to buy overpriced one? I mean, better one, for sure, but... Uh, for me, uh, Huion works fine. Uh, the other thing I almost forgot about, uh, the day I got it, uh, I, I mean, few days after, I um, dropped the pen and it's, it had trouble working. Fortunately, I uh, contacted pr uh, the producer with this problem and they sent me another pen that was working, so I now I am extra careful with this pen thingy <laughs> to never drop it, because uh, when I had Wacom, I drop it like all the time, like that was, I, I think I drop it too often, so now I'm extra careful when I drop it, I have a mini heart attack if, <laughs> if it's still working, so yeah, that's something you should also know. So overall, would I recommend this product? Uh, yeah, I think it it's fine <laughs> for the most parts. Uh, I would recommend it. Uh, you can just try it out and return it uh, if you don't like it. 
I mean, it has its flaws. It isn't perfect, so you just have. To, it's something you have to uh, consider. Um, but yeah, for the price, I don't know how about the newer products. I think they introduced the pen tilt, pen tilt thingy. <laughs> so yeah, I think it's much better now. Uh, but my uh, mine is fine. So yeah, I would recommend it. Just try it out. So yeah, if you're uh, really into. Uh, graphic design or drawing uh, with uh, computer graphics and stuff like that yeah so yeah that, that's all thanks for watching and see you next time bye bye